Example one: In a 100-meter athletic game, Rafisan runs from starting line and reaches 12 meters per second in four seconds. Find the acceleration of Rafisan. As usual, we list down all the information that we have. In 100-meter athletic game, all runners start from stationary. Therefore, the initial velocity u equal to zero. Rafizan reaches 12 meter per second in four second, which means the final velocity is 12 meter per second, and the time taken is four second. The mathematical formula of acceleration is a equal to v minus u over t. Plug in u, v, and t into the equation. The acceleration is equal to three meter per second per second. Example two: An object moves from stationary at a uniform acceleration of five meter per second per second. What is the velocity of the object after twenty second? Click on the answer buttons to proceed. The question states that the object moves from stationary. Hence, the initial velocity u equal to zero, acceleration is five meter per second per second, and the time taken is twenty second. We need to find the final velocity. Write down the equation a equal to v minus u over t. Substitute u a and t into the equation. Solve the equation. We get v equal to one hundred meter per second. These two examples show how we solve. A motion problem by using the equation a equal to v minus u over t. Deceleration. Let's look at this example. A motorcycle moving along a straight line. Its velocity decreases from 10 meter per second to 2 meter per second in 4 second. Therefore, the acceleration is negative 2 meter per second per second. When velocity decreases. Acceleration is negative, and we call this deceleration. In this case, the deceleration is two meter per second per second. Take note that when we use the word deceleration, the negative sign is omitted. Deceleration is defined as the rate of velocity decreases of a moving object. In other words, it is a measure of how fast the velocity decreases or how much velocity decreases in one unit of time.